Welcome, folks, to episode four, which is probably video five, but uh, who's keeping track? Welcome to Craft Riddle, and, you know, I was going to give these guys some time to do their own thing. I told them, I gave them a few more orders. I told them to do a few more things, and I was going to leave them alone and not record, but something important happened. Something very important happened. Migrants arrived. <coughs> At least... One so far, because I stopped it before anything happened. I'm not sure how they're going to actually get across the brook, because I'm pretty sure the brook is at least deep enough to drown people, but we'll see how they get across, if they get across. <laughs> <coughs> I might have to build a bridge. But let us peek at who this guy is. New arrival. He's an herbalist. And that's all he does. Okay. I can build another ladder. Alright, well, let's um, start working on them. Um, G. Did I just touch G? No? Did I not touch G? Oh, I did push G, but that's not the one I needed. Okay. Um, let's customize. His new nickname <coughs> uh, is he, well. First of all, actually, let's. He is married. Our first male married male. Okay, so N, married male, 101. We'll get to your professional name when I figure out what I want to call herbalist. So, okay, now let's let you let's start and he's going nowhere because he doesn't know how to get to the okay okay fine um we need to figure out how to get you across the the, the water <coughs> good enough Need nine blocks, so let's go to the blocks will be faster. Is he the only one? <coughs> Let me push you. He is the only one so far. Because well, we're not famous yet. We haven't done anything yet. We haven't uh, uh, exported any wealth. We've done nothing in the way of artifacts. We're nothing. Okay, so <coughs> I should probably tell them to make another ladder for gathering a fruit. Uh, ladder. And that one's just going to be a single job. I don't need a billion of those. And let's give it a little bit of a priority. Yeah. <coughs> so they're making drinks from plants. They are making the wooden doors I asked for. And they're checking on whether they should construct beds. Okay. Now let's see how they're doing up here. They don't really need to make beds. They've started on one of the walls. Okay, okay. You haven't cut down some of the trees I ordered. We're having trees that are getting close to the walls. New trees are getting close to the walls. and <coughs> I'm so sorry about that cough. I wasn't expecting to do a recording today. So, or at least not this right now. And I, uh, my throat was not doing too well. But, um, yeah, so we have a migrant, a single migrant, who is trapped on the wrong side of the river. And until they make a fl that floor, not even a bridge, it's just going to be a floor. <coughs> it's not going to be retractable. But I'm a little worried. <coughs> That's where the migrants are coming. Oh, here's another one. 
two migrants. V, not B. Okay. <clears throat> this is herbalist. Is this your wife? A dwarven child. Poet, speaker, dancer, singer, keyboardist. You have instrument. You actually have instruments. Or is that just your skills with certain instruments? Hmm. <coughs> okay, well, you are obviously, okay? So that makes you a, a single female because you're too young to have married. And you have no thing. Now, I'm going to make you, uh, what's, what name should I give you? Um, <clears throat> professional name, Fruit Killer? Fruity? Uh, I don't know, Fruit Collector would be the, I mean, a herbalist doesn't just collect fruit, he collects uh, tube, tubers and plants and veggie. Veggie? Eh, yeah, whatever. <clears throat> I'm not gonna, <laughs> yeah, go for it, you're a veggie now. And that's where you are, you're a veggie, veggie vegan. Vegan would probably be even better. That'd be even funnier. Let's do that. Because veggie is really just makes you sound like a, a, a vegetable. That's not exactly what you are. So, so kind of a vegan. Is that two G's? I don't care. <coughs> I'm an American. <coughs> so. so they're waiting for somebody to actually do something about making a floor. And somebody's bringing something, I think, over? No, he just crossed the brook. You could cross the brook without... Well, you little lazy bums. Well, then you don't need that, do you? Little lazy... <coughs> so he's... Okay. Uh, fish. So he's just come to fish. But he's on the... How did you cross that? That brook's not that. That brook is actually deep. Are you guys swimming? Huh. And what do we have here? A llama? A baby llama. Okay. <coughs> well, you could go with the water buffalo. And the dogs. There you go. Once I get somebody who could train, I could probably start working on the animals. <coughs> Excuse me. Is that a bee? I'm seeing a little yellow dot. As a bumblebee worker. So I'm assuming that's another uh, a bumblebee. So uh, can't really use bumblebees. Honeybees, yes. Bumblebees, no. So... Okay, either that's a new person or that is just <coughs> the same person going back. A miller. Oh, I, oh. We don't have a millstone or anything to do milling yet. In fact, I don't think we can. We don't have stone. I'll have to check on that. But uh, let me at least uh, give you a uh, custom uh, name. Um, well, I really should see. So, a uh, single female, at least of adult age, 103. <coughs> um, let me check on that, because I'm pretty sure uh, I need... Um, uh, um, uh, no. Oh, jeez. I'm pretty sure it was Servo Q. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. 
That's basically, a, kind of think of it as a, a millstone, but instead of being used by windmills, it's a small one where you, you, you move it with your hand. You know, it's basically, uh, there's usually a, a stick or something inside the top, and you kind of just kind of just grind it by hand. Um, <coughs> um, and we don't have any stone, so we can't mill anything, which means we can't make dye or... Um, and like that. I wonder if we can make a press. Um, I think we could probably make a press, but <coughs> without that ability to mill, a press really doesn't help anything. At least not immediately. Why are you guys just sitting there? There's, there's no meeting place. Oh, we don't even have a dining room. So there's no place for you guys to even come and meet. Okay, well, let's start working on the, uh... Start working on the, uh... Walls up here. Start working on the diamond room. Of course, we're going to have to work upstairs too, um, which means we're going to have to make it up and down. <coughs> so they basically started working on the second level of walls, and if they're going to have to cut down that tree, because that tree's already over where our walls are but um, they started as you can see started working over here so right here on the west wall <coughs> and they're starting to fiddle with the walkway over here they're starting to put the walkway down over here And they've already put the little end piece over here. So, yep, they're, they're up again. He's working. So they're working on the platform. So, all, and, and they're starting to work on the walkways here. <coughs> so what they need is tables, chairs, and stuff here. So I'm going to start asking them to, to finish the walls here. They're going to have to uh, get up here start laying up the foundation of some sort of roof here <coughs> these were the the end stones I asked them to put that one actually at the same time I asked them to put this one so that'll probably be the first one they make after these two this is right over the door because I wanted to uh, make sure that the door was capped off um, So the top of the wall counts as a floor, but I'm not sure that it would stop people from zigzagging through. Let's see if I could actually make a floor. See, this is a test to see if, if somebody could wiggle through. See, there's a floor there. Okay, so that works. Because <coughs> I actually put floorboards there, but that's the top of the wall, but a floor could still go there. So if these were just the top of the walls and a floor could still go there, that means you can zigzag through the cracks. I think I explained that in one of the other episodes. But uh, diagonal... You have to be careful about diagonal uh, entries. Because if you, didn't, if you, if you don't make sure... <coughs> for example, if, if you forgot to put a wall piece here and you put a wall here and a wall here, things could just go right through. It's like a it's, even though these two pieces of wall would touch here, things could still go through, and that's the same as a roof. If you put a, a wall, and then you put a roof, and you forget to put that little end piece there, it'll come through. And also, I think if even if you make a wall like three or four blocks high, if you don't put an overhang, some creatures could still climb up depending on their skill and how rough the wall is. If it's not smooth blocks, they could still uh, go. Yeah, see, they're they're working on the walkway over here. 
Not sure what he's doing. Oh, he's just skipping. Now, what I'd like to see is, um, whoops, too high, is to see what these dwarves are down here. Okay, there's more dwarves. For some reason, there's actually more dwarves now. <coughs> so it's to the U. Uh, so there's a crass dwarf who has not been named and a peasant. So, new arrival, bone carver. Oh, yes, please. Wax worker. Eh. Great student, wordsmith, writer. Well, when I get a library, I'll make you the writer. Or the scholar, because you got critical thinking. But let's give you uh, at least a custom... custom oh, wait, well, first let's see... Married female. So, and one oh four, I think now. Could be wrong. Three one oh two one oh four, yes. And there is a peasant who has nothing. <coughs> novelist, writer, novelist, poet. So this person is probably going to end up joining the military. Like it or not. Uh, married. And his wife is actually on the the one I just looked at. Well. Now, I can make one a scholar and one a scribe. When I get a library, that would help them work together. That is interesting used to be an apprentice under oh huh he dreams of creating a great work of art well I could make him a scribe and that would allow him to make books I'm not sure if that's great work of art because in the game I consider that great works of art but he might not um so married male 105 all right. <clears throat> and once again, I'm not sure why they're not over here. And I think of is that once again we don't have a great hall or any place for them to kind of conjugate around. Do we have blueberries growing in our fortress? Yeah, we do. Uh, guys, you could collect. You know, it's not a priority. Let's not make a priority. I don't want them to drop everything. But if it's in the, the fortress, you should be allowed to collect it. <clears throat> There's a blueberry. You know, collect them. Now, let's see. Um, no, they're still working on the walkways. Which are important because once they finish the walkways, they could start working on the next level of uh, walls and so on and so forth. But <clears throat> I didn't do the walkways totally around because I did want them to focus on the walls which were given the instructions to do the walls were given first so I'm kind of annoyed about that but once they finish the walkways they'll get down to the walls then we could design a dining room which can then also be considered a hallway <coughs> not a hallway but a great hall and are there more people showing up okay um that kid's doing make-believe. And that peasant's doing nothing. He's just a new arrival. And there's fish here dumped in the... Hmm. Where'd the others go? There's still a baby llama that has been put in the... Uh... Okay. Well, somebody's already constructing a building. So the other uh, others are already starting getting to work. I do have to put down at least another bed I think needs beds okay so they're not working on the beds yet <coughs> the managers got weird priorities but doors they've finished the doors um, I don't really have any place for the doors some walls 
Yeah, I know you need walkable. Shush. Uh, yeah, that is too big. There you go. And okay. <coughs> Guys, get get to the dining area. I really do need want the dining area fixed. <coughs> I mean, everything is important at this stage of development. Every single item we're doing is necessary for the survival of this fortress. And uh, that, now that we have a stock, okay, good, okay. So we have 12 population. We have 130 drinks, which is basically what you want with 12 population. Probably a little higher. Um, you want at least three times your population. So 130 is okay. Food stores is 472. We have 40 seeds. We have no fish or meat, but that's because the fish seems to be still at the brook. We have 92 plants. We should still probably try to process them <coughs> except we don't have a millstone or anything like that uh, we can't even make cloth um, and that's probably why they're using them for booze I think so let's let us check the kitchen barley blueberries so a lot of that's collected but we're getting seeds too walnuts we're, we're making walnuts into food uh, we still have a lot of booze. I like that. Donkey cheese. So this is the raw material. This is not the meals. When you see a short list like this, it doesn't mean you're starving death. It means most of the material you have has been put into um, the meals. And since he's done, he's doing stock. Let's see just how well the meals look. Uh, prepared meals. We have 67. Um. I'd like more than 67 meals. <coughs> Winter's coming. <laughs> Winter is coming. Stew, stew, stew. Oh, it's going to be a horrible... I don't have a lot of variety, do I? Uh, is there somebody currently actually making something? Um, okay. Brewing. Brewing, carpenter, carpenter, they're not doing stuff. Fishery still has to be made. Kitchen's not doing stuff. Oh, I don't like it when I can't see things being done. The problem is that we don't really have a lot of... Um... Oh, I set up refuge, uh, trash, uh, corpses, um, and, and uh, a garbage. <coughs> so we have stuff to dump. We have a dump, basically. We have a city dump now. <coughs> Excuse me once again. I'd take a cough drop, but then you'd be hearing me sucking the cough drop. And it'd be even worse. So. And those guys are now... Okay, somebody's bringing the llama. The kids just play make-believe. Nobody can order kids around. It just doesn't work. <coughs> but it looks like probably... I think those guys are going to... Uh, whoops. V and B are so close. So somebody's going to fish. Somebody's going to store item. So this guy's going to fish, and this guy's going to grab some of that fish and muscle and uh, muscles and put them into stockpile for us. <coughs> we're going to have a lot of seafood and dairy for the winter, and a lot of fruit. Uh, but all right. Oh, it looks like they're working on the walls. I think somebody's working on the walls. Please be working on. Yep. Okay. So they started to work on the walls. Once they finish the walkways, more of them will be working on those walls, and then we could start working on upstairs. And uh, we could uh, make a dining area. So I'll come back when they're uh, completed and started working on that. Or if anything else happens. Um, we are now from the midsummer, which you could tell by the fact of all the colors, the fruit trees, and uh, all that. And I think walnut and pecan and pecan. Oh, okay, that's not that. That's fruit. Willow. Willow. I could cut down willows. Fruit. I'm not sure what can go. 
that's even pronouncing it right. Yeah, some of these are just, I could just use for, uh, cut them down, use them for wood. Uh, plum, ooh, plum trees. So, <clears throat> now this area is the gathering area I assigned. Uh, let's see if we can see where the uh, ladders ended up. I got light on my screen, so I can't see. It would look like something uh, like a little P, <coughs> a letter P. It looked like that symbol for, um, I don't know, Byzantine or Byzantine Empire, depending on how you want to pronounce it. But uh, yeah, the, the gathering area, let me, let me push the I. That's the gathering area. So I might want to adjust that depending on how much stuff is out there. But the fact is, there's uh, all these little blue things. Blueberry bushes. Raspberry bushes. Broad bean plants. That's, that's still edible. Uh, pears. Uh, pear. Prisons? I, I don't... I, I think those... Uh, I don't... <laughs> blue bay. I don't know... Well, first, I can't pronounce that properly. Per simon simonon simmons uh prisms Blech. but aren't those little oranges dense grasses I thought that was a tree oh yeah I don't know that what kind of tree that is so I don't know if I'm getting anything out of it outside of wood now the funny thing is uh I've heard people talk about controlling the environment you know cutting down the trees you don't like and then only allowing trees you do like to appear. Uh, I'm not sure you could do that because you can't plant seeds of trees. You can't plant walnuts or acorns, or pecans. So you can't control what tree comes about. But you can stop trees from growing near uh, your uh, w uh, walls. Uh, once I, uh, they're high enough and I have enough dwarfs for a larger project I can uh, make roads and I could actually probably make uh, like a dirt road around the walls that would stop the trees from growing outside and if I was careful I could try to do it inside too uh, some of you are getting sick because I see a liquid black sand now they're just trampling at things so much they're starting to wear through the grass and the bushes Sand could be used to make glass, but I'm thinking we're probably going to make clay. All right, the, the chickens and the turkeys are doing okay. I'm not sure what's going on over here. Cave wheat needs to be uh, collected, guys. <coughs> We have farmers, right? Oh, the uh, ladder's back in the uh, stockpile. He returned the ladder back to the stockpile. Hmm. Or that's when he made. Hmm. Peasants. So he's just hauling stuff right now. All right. That's okay. He hasn't found his uh, his place in life yet. How are we doing job-wise? Growing from plants was active. Everything's checking. I don't like how everything's checking. Especially waiting. Um, they should have done the 50. Yeah, that, it might be that it, it's waiting. Because we do have more than 50 meals. Mm. <clears throat> but it should have at least done the first order. That's what's annoying because the drinks, the first order happened. They're making the drinks. 